poverty? Um, well, uh, yeah, when, uh, see, I would be sad if I, I have more and uh, another person has less. Uh, I would like to see uh, poverty in another sense, in the sense, um, poverty of what? Is it of the wealth or of the knowledge or um, uh, Oh, sometimes, you know, the poverty of health also is there, so, so many things, no? When I see a person with poor health and not able to cope up with this thing, then I feel a little bit, oh my God. Uh, and a person who's not having a single meal, maybe I get affected, okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, but I feel poverty by itself, uh, how you look, I don't know what you say to that. Um, I don't know how you, uh, how I can say it. Um, poverty should not make us miserable in that sense. You know, yeah. That we look okay. at it as a, it's okay in that sense. It's okay, but uh, it should not be that I have more and that person who next to me should not have less. Okay, yeah. okay, okay, okay. That way I feel. In that sense, when I look, when I go back and live in the village sometimes, or look at the where the people live, then that get, I, I get affected when I do see. But, um, as I said, those people are living so happily, then I feel so, okay, not so yes, bad. Yes, yes. yes. It, 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 it may define, we may define poverty for them. Yeah. And it's not what, they, what their way of living is and what, how they yeah, feel. Yeah. Because uh, I saw once uh, when I was in the slum, uh, you know, the, for that night uh, they had no food. Okay, mm -hmm. and uh, the children were playing and uh, so nice. So I went into the house and I asked that lady. So oh, I saw all your drums empty. There's nothing. Of course, there were only two things in the house. And I said, it's empty. What are you going to give the children this evening? Then she said, oh, if my husband brings something, uh, he might bring, and I'm waiting for him. And I said, if not, what? Then he said, oh, I have to make them drink some water and make them to sleep. That made me feel a little bit. Okay. But when I looked at the children, they were happy, they were playing. Mm -hmm. So what to say to that, I, I had no answer to that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Maybe leave it at that, yes? Yeah. Faith. Faith. Mm -hmm. That's what makes me work, I feel. <laughs> Faith. Uh, somehow I feel, no, in that sense, I am gifted by God with faith. Mm -hmm. Faith in people, faith in everything. Okay, and I don't know, when everything goes bad, I still I feel everything will be okay. Fine. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yes, uh, like uh, when uh, the, I had to empty the Raknari house and they said only this much time. I felt concerned, but in deep down I felt all will be okay. Mm -hmm. Everything will work out. Okay. And uh, so like that. So I, I for me, uh, to have faith is very, very important. And I tell the, teach, tell the children, don't get worried, all will be well. How do you get faith? Uh, but I don't know how it comes, but I think through experience, you know, because I've seen the things growing in a different way. So that also gives me a lot of um, confidence you know, in that sense. So oh, all will be well. That all will be well means that having faith. You know that. Now what is faith? I cannot explain, because once uh, in in my board of uh, trustees, and I said, oh no, don't get worried, all will be well. I, my faith tells me that. They asked me what is faith, I could not explain. But my believing system inside me tells me that all will be okay. Yes. You live it. Yeah, I live it. That's mm -hmm. it. Mm -hmm. Yes. Tolerance. <laughs> this also I feel I am blessed in abundance with tolerance. And that's why we, I'm able to live with people of all faith, making it, without making any difference. When living with people, I mean, uh, male and female, I have no, no problem. Uh, and I don't feel the difference in that sense. Yes, basically, 
male female but for something that's good you know that's why i look at it so absolutely no problem uh at all at uh, you know i sometimes i see very typical people but with me i can live with them uh-huh. yeah somehow there are some people who have uh, you know had such difficulties living with people but when they were in mahal they found it quite okay i don't know how they they said oh this is so nice you know the and when the same people go out they find it difficult so i don't understand why but for me i feel it is that um, you want me to speak more on tolerance sir huh? absolutely no oh, i think I it's think okay but yeah it, yes. i have no problem yes. yeah financial crisis wow this is going to be in life throughout i feel especially in the life of maher we go through that you know because if i have money i start more projects naturally so then you keep the crisis bit. going <laughs> but it's again i tell the faith is so much that i feel that also will be okay yeah. and then it's good to have financial crisis that's what i believe in because when we have financial crisis then the faith aspects becomes more strong yes. and there is no crisis and there is no need of faith no so it's good that things are there i feel to keep you on ground <laughs> yes wonderful it's a fresh look <laughs> it's a truly fresh look yes how uh, do you feel about working <laughs> what do you mean by that working <laughs> what do you do 24 hours a day <laughs> <laughs> working yeah that's what exactly we do from morning till evening we are doing something or other and find joy in everything that we do okay of course sometimes uh, like uh, working in the office is boring and i don't like it but then it's okay but because i know that I, what i do is uh, uh, having a positive effect on the children the women and so i work okay Uh, but um, some things are not like which we don't like it but then i must not say oh i don't like it i can't do it i don't want to do it mm-hmm. but if it is going to help another human being why not no so do it and that's what i tell myself because the way if i work in the office i know it's going to help hundreds of people so work with it okay. so i do it and then that gives me a lot of joy because i if i am not to work saying i don't like to work the, in the office then i would have seen um, that the children are not benefited or when women are not being benefited and uh, actually work i like is to be with the women to be with the children oh, that gives me so much of satisfaction but then i said to myself i am here for my self satisfaction or to see them growing so i had to make a choice and then i went to the office and started working in the beginning it was uh, like a telling on my health you know that's uh, even now it does but then i know that it is such a great thing to go and work there because it helps people so then i do it yes wonderful yeah <laughs> very good family uh now uh, in the beginning for me family was only my immediate family my family yes. my parents yes. and the same Uh, but as i grew uh, then i looked at the whole world is my family i started looking at that way then i started become very comfortable wherever i am whether in the slum or in the city with the poor or the rich i could be it started becoming very uh, so because i found the, uh, um yeah in the family means there's nothing to hide nothing to so wherever we are we uh, we have to be that way then we will find joy in doing that that's what i feel yeah wonderful